So now let's go ahead and analyze a, uh, the gain of a high pass filter. Once again, if you notice, the uh, high pass filter looks just like an inverting amplifier except for the capacitor down here. So let's go ahead and uh, replace that capacitor with an impedance that I'm going to call C1, Z1. And that's going to be equal to 1 over S. C1. So I'm going to replace that into here. So this is what we end up with. And once again, it's just all about applying the formulas I gave you in the first video of this uh, playlist. So this is the uh, voltage at the inverting input, voltage at the non-inverting input. And we also have our current, so this will be I in. And we're also going to have uh, I1 here. And I2 which runs across this resistor and from the formulas we know that I1 is equal to I2 since I in is equal to 0 and I1 is VI over Z1 then I2 is negative V out over RF. So solving for uh, V out over VI, we end up with, uh, with a negative RF over Z1. And so this is equal to negative RF over 1 over SC1. And that reduces to negative RF SC1. So this is your formula for a gain of this amplifier.